Welcome to Tech Blueprint, a window that lets you know the latest technology news in the world. The United States has successively adopted a series of repressive measures against Chinese high-tech companies such as Huawei and SMIC, trying to limit China's development in key areas such as semiconductors through technological blockades. Contrary to expectations, the Chinese chip industry has not only not been strangled, but has caught up in adversity and officially launched its own chip standard system in 2024. This is undoubtedly what the United States is most worried about. According to the article, in 2024, Huawei and SMIC, the two giants in China's chip field, took the lead and united more than 90 domestic first-line chip manufacturers to jointly establish an integrated circuit chip standards committee. This means that in the future, China will no longer passively accept the rules of the international chip market, but will take the initiative to formulate its own chip standards. This undoubtedly greatly enhances China's dominance and voice in the chip field, and also cuts off the control chain of the United States and other Western countries over China's chip industry. It is worth noting that this Chip Standards Committee not only plays a gatekeeping role, but will also actively promote domestic chip companies to develop independent products that meet the new standards. In this way, China's chip industry will no longer be controlled by others, and it is even expected to surpass the world's advanced level in some areas, and ultimately achieve true autonomy and control. U.S. technology blockade is no longer a threat. For many years, the United States has been trying to curb China's rise in the high-tech field by cutting off China's access to advance chip technology through technology blockade. However, with the establishment of China's independent chip standard system, this approach is no longer effective. With its independent standard system, China can selectively decide which chip technologies can enter the domestic market, which greatly reduces the threat of US technology blockade. Even if the United States escalates its technology blockade against China again, China has the ability to rely on independent standards and independent products to meet domestic demand, thereby avoiding this risk. Through the formulation and promotion of independent standards, China's chip industry is expected to catch up with or even surpass the world's advanced level in some areas. This means that some cutting-edge, chip technologies mastered by the United States may become outdated in the future and lose their competitiveness in the Chinese market. This will greatly weaken the United States' technological advantage, thereby making its technological blockade measures lose their due deterrent power. In summary, the establishment of China's chip standard system has completely subverted the United States' control over China's chip industry, making the United States' technological blockade no longer a threat. This is undoubtedly a major breakthrough in China's independent innovation in science and technology, and an important milestone in the Sino-US technological competition. In the future, China will further expand this advantage, promote the chip industry to achieve a greater degree of autonomy and control, and inject new and powerful momentum into the country's economic development. China's Path to Chip Independence from a Diversified Perspective Although China has successfully established an independent chip standard system, to ensure that this achievement continues to play a stable role, it still needs to be deeply thought about and comprehensively promoted from multiple angles. 
to ensure the effective implementation of independent standards, close cooperation, and coordination between enterprises in all links of the upstream and downstream industrial chains is required. Support Chinese scientists to develop high-tech products. China must continue to increase R&D investment in key core technologies, promote chip technology innovation, and constantly refresh and optimize independent products to ensure that they maintain lasting competitiveness in the market. China needs to improve the education system, optimize talent policies, and other measures to focus on cultivating and introducing a large number of outstanding chip technology talents to provide solid talent support for independent innovation. Although China has established independent chip standards, it still needs to maintain a certain degree of communication and cooperation with the international chip industry. Only by seeking win-win results in cooperation can China's chip industry achieve sustained and steady development. China's path to chip independence is a long way to go and needs to be systematically promoted from multiple dimensions. Only by achieving industrial chain coordination technological innovation drive, talent guarantee, and international cooperation, can China's chip industry truly achieve self-control and finally get rid of the shackles of the U.S. technology blockade and gain lasting advantages in the fierce international scientific and technological competition. Sino-U.S. technological competition intensifies and the U.S. suppresses Chinese companies. China will promote its own chip standard system in 2024 to break the U.S. blockade and enhance its dominance. This move reduces the threat of U.S. blockade and may surpass the world's advanced level. China needs industrial chain coordination, technological innovation, talent training and international cooperation to achieve self-control of chips. What do you think about this?